Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Are you tired of manually editing out the silent parts in your audio and video files? Do you wish there was a way to automate this time consuming process? Well, you are in luck. Today I'm going to show you a powerful tool that will not only save your hours of editing but is also completely free. So welcome to our tutorial on how to use auto editor. It's a command line application that automatically removes silences from your audio and video files. And the best thing is it is free to use and it has many options available to remove the silences from your audio and video. The next question is how to use auto editor. So there are three different steps to use auto editor. The first step is the installation. The second step is removing silences and then the third step is exporting in your desired format. So let's start. So you can go to autoeditor.com on this website you will see all the details about auto editor. The first step is to install. You can click see installing for additional information and it will take you to this page. So first of all we need to download and install python 3. To check whether the python is installed on your operating system or not you can search for command line and then here you can type python dash dash version. If you press enter it will return python 3.10.11.9 or any version you have installed. If it says the Python is not recognized, then it means the Python is not installed on your operating system. So to install the Python, you can go to Python 3, open this link, it will take you to python.org, you click download Python 3.11.4 and it will download the setup for you. Once the setup is downloaded, I have already put the setup here. So we can open it and then you can click install now and it will install the python 3.11 version on your operating system and don't forget to check add python.exe to path this will add the python to your environment variables as python is already installed for me so i'm not going to click install now but for you you can click install now and it will install the python on your operating system once the installation is complete you can close the setup then you can go back and again you can type python dash dash version and it will show the python version installed on your operating system perfect once python is installed you should have a pip on your path you can confirm this by running pip3 in your command line if you get a list of commands you are good to go if not you should reinstall your python next we need to upgrade the pip to the latest version by running pip install upgrade pip so we say pip if you don't want to type, you can simply copy this and paste it here and press enter. And for me, I already have the latest version of the pip, so it's a requirement already satisfied. Once we have the latest version of the pip, we can install auto editor by typing pip install auto editor. So I copy and paste it here and press enter. So for me, I have already installed auto editor. So it's a requirement already satisfied. If you are installing auto editor for the first time, it will install some required libraries and you are ready to go. To check whether the auto editor is installed properly, you can copy auto editor dash dash help and paste it here. If you press enter, so it will return some list of commands that can be used for auto editor. So perfect. Now, let's move on to the fun part. I have already recorded a test video and placed it into a video edit folder. Let's have a look how this video looked like. So you can see this is my raw recorded video and there are a lot of silences in this video. If I try to remove these silences manually, it will require a lot of efforts and it may take more than one or two hours. Let's see how we can remove these silences using auto editor. So we go back to our command prompt and here first of all you need to change the command prompt to the folder where your video is located. So I can copy this path, go back and I can say change directory cd to this path. Perfect. Now you are in the directory where your video is present. Now let's go back to autoeditor.com and to edit the video this is the command. So we paste it. As I already have my video in the same folder where I have opened the command line, if your video is not in the same folder, you can specify the complete path. 
but for me my video is in the same folder so i will remove the path auto editor and then you can specify the name of your video so the name of my video is test video dot mp4 i will say test video dot mp4 if you just enter this command it will execute remove all the silences and export your video into dot mp4 format if you want to rename your file name you can say dash output and you can specify the name of the file you want to save so i can say test edit one and then press enter so you can see it extracted the audio and then start creating the new video in the new video it will remove all the silences from the audio and video and save it as test video edit one so let's wait for it to complete so it has completed and created a new file with name test edit one and to check out whether the silences has been removed or not let's go back to camtasia i will import that file here test edit one open it and then i can place it onto the track three so you can see in my edited video auto edit have removed all the silent parts and the length of my video has been reduced from approximately 11 minutes 42 seconds to only 5 minutes 47 seconds so it removed the silent parts of approximately 6 minutes in just one or two minutes okay perfect now let's try to see some other options you can specify to remove the silences from your video we can go back for example cutting you can change the pace of the edited video by using margin option so margin adds in some silent sections to make the editing feel nicer for example you can say hey at each cut add a 0.2 second margin before and after that cut so we can copy and paste this command to our editor and don't forget to change the name of your file so for me it's test video dot mp4 slash margin 0.2 second and if you like to give the name of the file you can say output video edit and press enter so again it will analyze the audio and then create a new video with 0.2 second margin before and after each cut to make it more nicer so by default you see auto editor will save your file into the same format you provided however you can also export your video to various editors like adobe premiere pro format davinci resolve final cut pro and shortcut using the export option so how to use it so it's say exporting to different editors so you can copy this command go back to editor and paste it so you can specify your file name testvideo.mp4 and it will convert your video into a premiere pro format similarly you can also specify export resolve or davinci resolve export final cut pro and shortcut as well other editors like Sony Vegas, they can understand the Premiere format. So you can use the Premiere format export into Sony Vegas as well. In case, if your favorite editor does not exist here, you can use export clip dash sequence, which creates many video clips that can be imported and manipulated like normal. So let's execute this command. And if you like, you can also specify the file name. And this time it will export the video into premiere pro format let's go back and you can see it has created dot xml file and you can export it into premiere pro perfect if you don't like this command line interface and you want to use a software so auto editor also have an app so if you click the app you go here so you can see they also have an app for windows and mac but you have to buy it so if you click buy now the total cost is $35 for the lifetime so you just make a payment after the payment you will be sent an email with the link to the app to be downloaded and there you have it so you have just learned how to automatically remove silences from your audio and video files using auto editor saving your valuable time and efforts remember auto editor releases new versions every week with improvements and bug fixes you can upgrade by running pip install auto editor dash upgrade I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, 
feel free to leave them in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more tech tips and tricks. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Until then, happy editing.